when we thought of our timeline, we thought of it over a two-year period. Um, and we started off, um, as many other groups, as listening in the community, figuring out um, concerns and the actions that people want to take, getting to know the area. And we thought the different uh, tools that could be used could be something like um, Yammer uh, for, for telling stories, things that people say. Um, group texting for communicating with um, with people as you build up build up networks of people around different ideas. Online mapping when you've met people, you can drop pins in maps so you can map out where you've where you've met people. Um, Dropbox for if you want to share any documents, any notes internally. Um, but also getting in contact with the other organisers in Slapham because um, you could. You could also work work together on certain things as the as the work develops. Um, then looking towards supporting people to take different actions, so project development or campaigns, um, perhaps something like a community celebration, perhaps something like merging the community association and the park, uh, both of which aren't doing particularly well uh, individually, but together perhaps could work quite well. Um, and then looking at perhaps using Twitter, Facebook for publicizing those things. And then in the year two, it's a case of, well, who knows what's going to happen because you're not going to know that until you've actually worked with the community, listened to them and figured out what their priorities are. Um, and so things that could emerge could be things like a community news blog where they're telling their own stories, could be things like an online um, notice. They could use things like Skype for meetings, but that's all very dependent on whether they've got the technology to use that. Perhaps they could identify um, with the community organisers their own training needs, things that they might need to do. But again, until you've actually engaged with the residents in the community, it's quite difficult to tell what their uh, technical needs are going to be. And I think that's kind of the conclusion we ended up with.